Mega Medusa, the newest web data attack tool. Who is behind it? How is it related to the hashtag free Pavel movement? Why is it dangerous and how can we stay protected? Hello everyone and welcome to another Radworth Red Bite. I'm Eva and I'm here to give you the essentials on the global cyber threat landscape in just a few bites. Have you heard of the new web TDoS attack tool called Mega Medusa? This tool is making headlines for its unique capabilities. But who is behind it? Why is it so popular and how can we stay protected? Let's break it down. The malicious group behind this tool and constantly updating it to make it stronger is RipperSec a pro-Palestinian and pro-Muslim Malaysian activist group. Their Telegram channel, at Reprosec, was created in June 23 and accumulated over 2,000 subscribers in over a year. Recently, they have been very active around the arrest of Telegram CEO Pavel Dura. A few weeks ago, they have launched Mega Medusa, a publicly available web DDoS attack tool published on GitHub. It can be installed in just five simple commands, allowing anyone with poor resources and hacking knowledge to launch highly scalable web DDoS attacks against targets of their choice. The Mega Medusa attack tools uses 10 randomization techniques to diversify its attack request and make the detection and mitigation of its attacks harder. The tool can even evade capture triggers through randomization and proxy use. Reprosex threat and scale do not come from a large and sophisticated attack infrastructure, but from its community. And as we know, community has always been hacktivists' most powerful weapon. This tool is real threat to organizations that do not have a dedicated solution to face sophisticated web DDoS attacks, especially when they use randomization techniques. The only way to accurately block these attacks without blocking legitimate traffic is with automated algorithms that create and deploy signatures in real time, adapting as the attacks is morphing with no human intervention. Thank you for joining us today and please make sure you stay protected.